Hey, what's up everybody? It's Coach Lisa with the Running University, helping people celebrate finish lines they never thought possible, helping people put the fun in their run. I've got a little bit of a different background going on. That's because I just got, um, probably about half an hour ago, walked into the Airbnb in Rocky Point. So I am not going to take too much time, but I am doing my weekly 5.30 p.m. lives on Instagram following, I don't wanna say my weight loss journey, that sounds, I might say exaggerated, but kind of, because I do need to lose some weight. So, um, hey Christine. So again, these are gonna get recorded. They're going on my YouTube channel as well. And I'm gonna make this one a little short because I did just get here um, to Rocky Point and I have a group coaching call at six o'clock with my tribe. Um, we start off our programs, uh, starting with Jackass training and Frenzy 50K training. But anyway, just to recap last week, I did not weigh myself today. And last week, my goal was to track four times and get back on track with my um, running and um, strength training. So I tracked four times last week. It felt really good. I tracked Monday through Thursday. I think I made up for all the food <laughs> calories that I didn't have on Friday, Saturday, Sunday, but all good. I did track. Um, I, I skipped a running day. I also skipped a strength training. Uh, part of it was just because I'm recovering from Trans Rockies, even though I feel good. Um, I was able to sleep a lot more last week. I think I was catching up on sleep. So I honored um, myself. So my two messages this week are one, to give yourself grace. I'm all about having goals, but sometimes you just have to give yourself a little break. And I'm just starting back up. So I felt good about the fact that I did do four days. So always celebrate the little wins. And then also giving myself some grace this week. I'm not even going to put a food goal this week. I'm in Mexico, y'all. I, I can't be, I can't be setting, I can't be counting my calories. I know some people do it when they go on vacation. They stay really true to their you know, calories and all the things, you know, I'm not going to go crazy, but at the same time, you know, I'm here I'm in Mexico. Um, you know, I'm going to eat the chips, probably have a few beers. And even though I'm on vacation, I actually came here to get work done. Believe it or not, I have some writing that needs to get done and nothing better to do it in Mexico. Actually, maybe I'll show you guys my cool view. I tried to do this. Oh yeah, here we go. I'm going to show you the view from our place right here. I'm in the Sonoran Sea and Spa. And I'm going to be working, staring at this, <laughs> and then, of course, going back down and um, doing, uh, and then coming back up and working. I'm trying to get this to come back to me. Whoops. Anyway, um, I think my Wi-Fi is okay. Whoops, no, I just switched this back. It's faster than I am. Here we go. All right, so there you have it. So this week, um, I still plan on sticking to my strength training. There is a gym here that I'm going to take advantage of. I am going to do my running workouts while I'm here. I'm going to walk on the beach at least at sunrise and on sunset for sure. So So I'm going to get plenty of walking in and the running, I'll see how it goes on where I feel safe to run. Um, obviously the beach might be an option, of course. So anyway, so this week I'm going to just, you know, keep an eye on things, but I'm not going to get super crazy. And then when I get back next week, I'll really be a little more hyper-focused because the tracking really does make me feel, um, it just makes me feel good to know that I'm tracking and I have a better grip. I have control over what's happening. So that's what's happening today. I'm going to let you all go. And I'm always going to be on until I reach my goal, I guess, at 5.30 p.m. on Instagram Lives on my channel. So thank you guys for listening and talk to you later. i got to remember how to.